But first tonight, the supersonic jet maker on its way to the triad is sending shockwaves with its new designs. Boom Supersonic released new images of the jet it plans to build at PTI. Good evening, I'm Chad Silver. And I'm Julie Luck. The company is set to break ground on its facility later on this year. WFMY News 2's Grace Holland gives you a closer look at the designs and progress at the construction site. This is what Boom Supersonic says its Overture jet will look like. The company revealing the concepts after it says it did testing and simulations. The plan is for this to be a supersonic jet, like the Concorde, but more environmentally friendly. Boom says the jet will be able to carry up to 80 passengers at twice the speed of today's jets. It wants to build the planes by 2025 and carry passengers by 2029. Before it builds the planes, it's got to build the factory. PTI's executive director, Kevin Baker, says there's been a lot of progress at the site in the seven months since Boom was announced. We're grading it. In fact, we've got a lot of the site at grade at this point. Uh, we continue to walk, work with the company um, as they, they lay out their facilities and uh, modify that design. And it's, you know, that this is a very fast paced project and luckily we had a lot of this underway. There's still road work and other improvements needed at the site, all in the works. Boom is projected to bring 1,700 jobs to the airport, but Baker says more could follow as other companies take notice. There is a lot of activity right now, like I've never seen. Um, normally, if you had one big project that you were working, um, that was a lot. And now there are more than 10. So there's a lot of, uh, a lot of interest in the airport. Boom also announced it'll partner with Northrop Grumman to make military versions of the Overture for the federal government. The company is also a partner with United Airlines, which wants to use the jets. An exciting time, Grace, thank you. Boom says its jets will be fast, will be able to travel faster than the speed of sound, more than 750 miles per hour. Boom says this extra speed will allow pilots to cut flight time in half, but it says passengers won't be exposed to what are called sonic booms. It's basically a loud noise similar to thunder once the plane moves faster than the speed of sound. Boom says jets won't fly faster than the speed of sound while over land. 